so we're here in Belfast. That's why we're standing in the rain. And there are protests here. And not one single student, not one single person in their 20s, all of them who had student loans, not one of them understood that they had been Cyprus while they're out here planning a, a new alternative, a new world as possible. And the world is getting older and older, in fact. It's becoming more and more neo-feudal. And as part of this financial war, you could see they also have financial war propaganda because Rothschild's bank in these documents dub it the Project Hero. The author suggests a script for ministers to persuade graduates to accept the worsening of their conditions. Quote, we all live in difficult times, they suggest ministers argue. You have a deal which is so much better than your younger siblings. They will incur up to 9,000 pounds tuition fees and up to RPI plus 3% interest rates. Yeah, these young students in the generation before, they, they do propaganda films, be a hero, go fight a war to make us rich. They did that for the, all the previous wars. Now they're saying, well, now what we're going to do is we're fighting a financial war. Be a hero. Allow us to retroactively raise the interest on those student debts by 300%. You have no say in it whatsoever. They're non-recourse loans. You're going to be okay to pay for that debt, of course. You can't get a job you want to get. You got to get a job for a mercenary. Got to get a job for Blackwater. Got to get a job for a surveillance. Got to get a job for the police state. Got to get a job spying on your parents, spying on your kids, spying on yourself to make the payments of the interest rate on the student loan that's been tripled thanks to the Rothschilds. What a bunch of bums and piss ants.